I want to look at how we can disassemble the bolt on the uh, Zestava M07, um, which would be something that's quite commonly needed to do for lubrication and so on and checking and cleaning. And um, it can be a little bit tricky. Some people never take their bolts apart, but it can be a useful exercise. All right, so this is this is the bolt. Now it's a Morser style um, bolt on the way it's designed, but in order to take it apart, the the simplest way is we put the bolt in, we lower the bolt, and we put the safety in the um, the middle position. That's a three position safety. This position locks the bolt. The middle position here, it is locking the firing pin. So when we pull back the bolt and we remove it, now the uh, the firing pin is locked. So this allows us to, if we press this little locking lever in, I don't know if you can see it, there's a locking piece here. We push this in, and we can see that the uh, um, this is all locked here and I can unscrew it and the firing pin doesn't fall. So we keep this piece pressed back. Yeah. Keep this pressed as much as possible until we get it loose. Now we can unscrew the outer part of the bolt body as such. Okay, so that's um, that's how that operates. So here we see the firing pin spring and the firing pin, um, and this is clean, but uh, often there's a lot of uh, soot, dirt can get back in here um, and cause binding. And when we put it back together, this might have get rusty if it gets dampness or anything inside here, so it's good to lubricate it. And uh, I normally put a little bit of grease on some of these components here. Just a bit of super lube, which is one of my favorites. Put them in there, a little bit on the thread. It's already got some on it in this case. Smear that around. Before we put it back. Yeah, and we would normally, yeah, if there's any you could uh, put a patch down in here with some oil on it to clean out the inside of the bolt body. And then reassemble as such. Screw it on. And as it gets in a bit further, you have to push back this here to allow it to rotate. Which has got a fairly strong spring. Okay, that's it. You can see here, it's a bit hard to see. So as we screw it up, it's important that it's fully screwed in or else the firing pin, uh, it's possible to lock this up in a position so that the firing pin uh, is too far retracted. So there's a space in here. I don't know if you can see that with the camera, that um, as it screws up, push this in, got to go right around push it in again and there it locks in you can see that in here it's screwed right in the bolt handle uh, there's no, it couldn't go another turn and that that's very important now we can put it back in the rifle check it's operating the safety is working all well now it's locking it's free in this position fully forward so that's it and it's uh, it's ready to go again so that's how you disassemble the bolt in for lubrication and inspection